Welcome to another video. Today we are going to be going to Yasu. It is very early in the morning. We are at Seoul Station and I'm here with my mom. Hi. Hi. So we are going to be going to Yasu. It is her first time. So it's very excited. You guys have been seeing her a lot in the vlogs because we've been traveling a lot this month. But nonetheless, I hope you guys enjoy it and I'll see you guys in Yasu. Bye. All right, guys. So we are at our first destination. We are at Odongdo, and we are actually walking kind of like a course right now. And she's explaining to us about the different trees here on the island. And yeah, didn't think that there was gonna be a hike involved, but we're good right now. But um, why does it feel like it's never ending? <sighs> Holy crap. Look at that. We still have a lot more to go. Oh, we have a lot more to go. All right guys, we made it to the top of the lighthouse and when you come up the top of the lighthouse, you can see the foliage and you can also see the boats on the side right here. Also, you can spot the cable cars. I actually rode the cable cars before and I say if you are in Yosu, it is definitely an experience but this tour bus and the course that we are on, um, we just came to the lighthouse, so yeah. Basically, this is a display of how Yosu would have looked like when Sunshin was here. As you guys can see, this is just a model. She was explaining to us in depth about everything that Yusu Shin did for Yasu and why he was in Yasu and then all of this. So we just came out of the museum and if you guys are interested in knowing about Yusu Shin and the history, I definitely recommend coming here before you guys go eat because there is a Shijang nearby and a lot of places to eat. So we are going to be going and making our way to eat lunch. We are pretty hungry and we are going to... Like, oh, okay, so we're gonna eat pig bun um, and yeah, I'll show you guys what's up. So this is the Cha Suyang Food Culture Street. There is a lot of aesthetic cafes here, a lot of mandu places. So it seems like this mandu place is really popular. You guys can also try hotdogdang here, which is like really good street food. So we decided to go to Pekgum Shikdang. Okay, mom, lead the way. Lead the way. If you guys come in here, you guys should definitely order the set because that is what they are famous for. So I know that spicy marinated crab is really in, but if you guys haven't tried soy sauce marinated crab, I definitely recommend trying kanjang gejang out. This is going to be in the set. Also, we have tenjang jjigae and then kimchi. This is going to be mustard kimchi, which is kat kimchi. I really love this kimchi. If you guys like a little bit of spice and a kick, I definitely recommend getting this one. And then we also have fish right here, which is grilled, and also some hanchans. Again, meet my favorites. This is my mom, she's cutting everything. This is going 
gonna be so good. Oh my god. So they call kanjang jajang a pakdodo, which basically means it's like a rice thief or like a rice dealer. Basically means that you just eat like endless amounts of rice. Kanjang jajang is actually like my favorite, favorite type of food and Korean food. So I'm glad that we got to eat it. It's usually pretty expensive, but here the set is really cheap. So if you're around the area, definitely recommend this spot if you guys want to eat Korean food. Little tip when you're eating kanjangejang, you want to get some of the soy sauce and then eat it with your rice. The best. The best. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> Alright guys, so the food was definitely a 10 out of 10. I am going to be making my way out and looking around. Uh, there is a lot of stuff to do on this tour still, so please continue to watch. And I'm so full. I probably need some coffee or like some dessert, so let's get going. We are gonna go to Yeosu Yuja and it is like it looks like this. You can see Izun Shin on Kabuksan and then if you go a little bit on this side. There's places to sit down. We're gonna be eating our ice cream. That is our bus right there, so it's really easy to find. I'm almost like, where's our bus? And I was like, it's yellow, I don't know. So that is the Yasu City tour bus, as you guys can see right here. Ta -da! guys to our next destination let's go As you guys who might be wondering the tour that I did is the first course This is a North Korean submarine that South Korea found. We are taking a look. I've never seen a submarine up this close. Hi! <laughs> Guys, it is ooh, sprinkling a little bit, but guess who got a umbrella? The walk up is pretty intense. Just letting you guys know. She's making the kimchi. Wow. I feel like a lot of people buy kimchi here, so uh -huh. if you guys want to buy kimchi, uh -huh. definitely recommend buying it here. So I am gonna warn you guys, it is quite a hike. So if you guys don't like the hike, I don't know if you guys can go all the way up to the top, but I am gonna show you guys, for those of you guys who might be interested in actually going all the way to the top. Okay, it's like, this is crazy. But I think we're almost there, so we're going to keep going up. Oh, what? Okay, I'm going to try doing a new shot. I'm going to be doing... Using one up for my phone. Whoa, it's getting narrow. It's getting narrow. Okay, it's getting narrow. You good? Oh, okay. I'm skinny. She said I'm skinny. Whoa. 
이거 다 이거 본거 같아. 진짜? 어, 처음 봐. 유튜브에서. 어, 야, my mom watches more YouTube than I do. We made it to the top. It's so beautiful. Wow. That was a good hike. I haven't gone on a hike like that in a really, really, really long time. So that was quite refreshing. And we need to make our way back down. It is a little bit sprinkling. So I definitely recommend checking the weather. And if it's raining too hard, I don't think this is a course that you should do. But if it's just sprinkling, you guys can be careful and go up just like I did. All right, guys, so we are on our way back down. And I just want to take a rest bay because I wanted to let you guys know that if you guys are visitors here, you guys don't need to worry. The tour guide is Korean, but you guys can download an audio guided service called ODDI on KTO. It has Korean, English, Chinese, Japanese, so you guys don't need to worry about that and it'll be very helpful for your guys' trip so you guys can understand the whole trip and everything that she's explaining. Hi everyone, I'm Dina! Nice to meet you guys! Yes, we actually were like on the same course and yeah. everything so go check out her video mm -hmm. as well. Thank you! Little Red Riding Hood. Thank you! <laughs> There's literally like every type of dried fish here. That's crazy. So at this fish market there is raw fish and then also dry fish. My mom bought some dry fish for she bought some dry fish for just soups or just to eat. Oh, you can just eat. Oh, yeah. So she said that you could just grill it and fry it. So, yeah, she bought some fish. Uh, I don't know how that's going to be on the way back because it might smell, but she did it anyways and she got a good deal. So, we're just going to look around more now. So, now we're at the place where they have like live fish. You can just pick it out, whatever you want, and then you can cut it up and then they'll actually take it out for you and you can eat it, take it full. Or they have like reserved restaurants at the top where you guys can eat it. It's very similar to Nodongji if you guys have been in Seoul, but if you guys are in Yeosu, definitely come here because Yeosu is known for their seafood. So we have a lot of food. We also have a lot of sea urchins, abalone. Honestly, if we weren't going back to Seoul, I would definitely eat here. Could she? Seoul, I'm coming in. We would have eat here. All right, guys. So we just came out of the fish market, and basically, it is time for us to go back to Seoul. Today I had such a fun time. It was my second time in Yosu. The first time I went with the girls, and then the second time I came with my mom. Uh, it was actually a lot more fun because I feel like. With the girls, I did more cafe stuff, and then with my mom, I did more nature and a lot of eating. So, how was your day today? What was your favorite part? Odondo. So, Odondo was the first place that we went to. Definitely, you can't see that in Seoul, right? Seoul is just a poor So, Oman Odondo was the first so personally for me, I liked Hangiram because it was quite of a walk, but it was a very good sight to see. It was a little bit like slippery during the rain, but definitely I feel like this whole trip was a good mix of like food, nature, and I think that's the wrap for today. Thank you guys so much for watching this vlog for my Yosu and my Paju vlog, and I'll see you guys soon. Bye! Bye. It's almost like when we first met. Oh, I don't care, it's getting too late. I want you.